Hey, it's Chris again. <clears throat> um, this is just a quick update. Um, just want to talk about some of the stuff going on in my life since the last time I made a post. Um, I started on this liver cleansing program with my chiropractor. Um, it's called Isogenics or something. Um, sort of a sparse eating type thing. Um, like a special shake in the morning, small lunch, another shake, and I can eat like two almonds every hour and a half and like 70 ounces of water a day, the minimum, or something. Um, so, I'm really struggling with that because I like food a lot, and I like cheese, and cheese is not a lot on this diet. So, it's only 11 days, so we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm getting my second testosterone shot this afternoon, actually in like an hour and 40 minutes, so I have to leave soon to go to Boston for that. Um, and I also just finished reading some book. Um, I didn't like all of it, but some of it was pretty interesting. The, um, The Testosterone Files by Max Valero. Valerio? Anyway. Um, and I just found this one part to be kind of interesting at the back about, um, crying. About a lot of trans guys saying that they don't cry as much after they start testosterone. And I thought that was kind of interesting because a little after I started testosterone, I started to feel a little bit more emotionally stable as well. And um, at the end of a sad movie, I didn't cry, which I was kind of proud of myself because I always felt kind of like a, I don't know, a wuss crying at the end of sad movies all the time. So, or like commercials with puppies jumping around in the yard. Oh, oh, puppies. So. Uh, I feel a little better about about that, and I just thought it was interesting and thought maybe someone else had um, some thoughts that they might want to share about that. So, if you have any response to this post, I also I'll always welcome responses, and I'd like to thank everyone who subscribed, viewed, or commented on my last post. It's good to have a lot of support. Thanks, guys. Um, see you next post.